Hi guys, Lee from Evebs here. Uh, just wanted to do a quick run over of the uh, Aegis Legend mod. Uh, so this is the second of the series. Uh, they did have the Aegis, just the 100 watt mod. Now they've came out obviously with the 200 watt mod, dual 80 and 650s. Uh, so I really just wanted to give you a run over of the device anyway. So um, it's a double 80 and 650, uh, 80 and 650 battery um, mod. It, uh, it's waterproof, supposedly. We have water here anyway, we can run it through a test and we see how that goes. Um, obviously, a lot, of this, a lot of times when you get phones, any other devices, when they say they're waterproof, it's not really the case. They could be they could be waterproof to a certain extent, you know. Um, but I wanna see, I've seen a few people do it already, but I wanna see for myself and I wanna show all you guys if it's true. Um, so, let me see. Yeah, so basically, I'm just going to go close up on this one. So here's your battery door, okay? Uh, sealed off fairly nicely. Uh, so there's obviously my 8650 batteries, two of them. Uh, obviously get your plus and your minus in there. One thing about this though, is you can't just clack it back down, okay? You need to pull the door back and push it in, okay? I think that's sort of the feature for it being waterproof, I, I think that needs to be there. Uh, it, it is a bit of an inconvenience, but if you're not, if you know, if you're going to drop this in water, I suppose you're lucky. Um, also, the USB. If you're going to upgrade, update the software on this, uh, or you're just, which I don't re recommend doing, but if you're going to charge it through, you're just going to put it in this little slot here. Okay. Uh, don't know if you can see that very clearly, but you're just putting it in here. So this this device is obviously going to be, if it works to its full potential. Which I'm I'm gonna check in a minute. It could be good for anybody who's had a hazard of, you know, who's a hazard of breaking devices or whatever. Um, so we'll give it a run through anyway. Check it out with the water. Let's see how that goes. Okay, so the batteries are in. Just turn it on. You see the batteries are in there, full power. Just no tank on it at the moment. Okay. Sparkling water, ultimate test. So. One eternity later. Still no problems, doesn't seem to be. Now let's just see if she'll fire. Working fine, absolutely no issues from it. I believe, I don't know, I might have to drop this in water a couple more times to get a full all round picture of this device, but so far this is the third time we've dropped it in today and it's completely fine. I would recommend these, now we do have them on evebs.ie. Uh, you can order with multiple colors. We've got the blue, the red, the brown leather, snake skin, Orange, dark green, most people's favourites, the rainbow, and then just your de your straight on black but it has the red lining on the back there, the stitching. And that's pretty much it, so if you found this video at all helpful, uh, just drop a like, give it a share, uh, share on eBeps. you know, we hope we can do a few more of these, I know I messed up a little bit through this, I suppose it's a bit nerve wracking. Um, but, you know, with time, hopefully I'll get better at this. The next, hopefully the next video that I get to do anyway is of the Falcon tank. Uh, any customers that I've dealt with in Bray know that I've been raving about the tank, the coils, everything about it. So I just love to get, like, get through with that for you guys. So, yeah, thanks all for watching. And, uh, yeah, give us a share and a like. Thank you.